Mike Alexandrov right out of that Hunter breaststroke. Got to be happy with the 1006 right now. Yeah, definitely. So what were you realistic? What were you expecting to be around tonight? Uh, I wanted to be 005, 006, quite honestly. I just wanted to be faster than I was in Orlando. You were out a 28.4. How do you feel about that? It was good. The sun was right in my face. First 50. Well, actually, that's one of my favorite things, is swimming into the sun. Um, so that kind of gave me a little extra boost inspiration with the expense of not being able to see where the wall was. <laughs> <laughs> how, how has it been swimming outside here at Mesa? Oh, it's awesome. I love swimming outside. I moved to Arizona four years ago to train in Tucson. I live in LA now, but I love the sun. I love the Arizona sun. What are your thoughts? Just curious. I know it, it's it's most important in the big pool, but after watching men's NCAAs and how fast the Hunter breaststroke has gotten short course, what are your thoughts on Kev Kevin Cordes and the times that he was posting in that Hunter breaststroke? It's inspiring. Um, I think it's, it's something that I can definitely learn from. Uh, you know, I was the fastest 100 and 200 yard breaststroker, and then he just destroyed all my times and uh, it's it's an honor to be able to you know now learn from him I, uh, I think it's I have a lot to learn and what do you need to focus on in your hunter brushstroke long course in order to be competitive get the top two slots in that event um, just keep doing what I'm doing. I think the work that I do with John Urbanchek and Dave Salo is great. And so just keep it up another two months. All right, good job. Thanks.